Have you ever tried to use data to make predictions? We can make predictions using linear models. Take a look. If you look at this graph, you can see that as the x values increase, the y values increase also. We want to make a prediction. We want to know what value we would graph at 6. To figure this out, let's look at the values that are already graphed and put them in a table. If you look at these values, each one increases by 3 on the y axis. If we do that to the next value after 16, you would see that the next value that we would graph is 19. And we can draw that actually right about there. When you look for values that are beyond a data set or before a data set, we call that linear extrapolation. And we can use that to make predictions. We can also look at making predictions within a data set. If you look at this data set, it moves along very nicely between the years of experience and the income that someone makes. Except for right here, where there's a gap. There's a gap between what someone makes at about 12 years and what someone makes at 14 years. If we wanted to figure out what someone made at 13 years, we would use linear interpolation where we're going to find a value between two points. The key word with linear interpolation is that it's between values that have already been graphed. So let's look at what we already know. We know that at 12 years someone is making approximately $36,000. And at 14 years someone is making $40,000. We want to know what they're making at 13 years. We can do this a couple of different ways. We can look at it logically. Logically by looking at the distance between these two values. We could say that someone at 13 years is making about 38000 We can logically figure that out. We can also add these two values together and take the average. If we add these two, we end up with 76 as an answer. If we divide that by 2, we get $38,000. Working in this way between data points is an example of linear interpolation. To review, we use linear extrapolation to predict before or beyond a set of data. We use linear interpolation to predict between values in a data set. Take a minute to copy these down in your notebook. You can use them the next time you want to make predictions by using a set of data.